Hi there. My name is Jack. I'm a coffee technician with High Touch Business Services. I want to show you these three most common cured machines and show you how to clean them up and get them ready for service again. I know that we've all been out of the office for a while and these things have been sitting idle for weeks or months. So let's go over the easiest way to clean these. And the truth is we're going to use the machines hot water to clean the machines. Now the first thing I would suggest you do is you get some sort of cleaning agent that is non-abrasive and is non-biological. So anything like a simple green or really just the hot water is the safest thing. When you come up to the 1500 unit, I highly recommend you brew it first. And then when you're finished, wait a second to let the hot water drip out. Remove this K-cup holder by sticking both your fingers, prying outwards, and the entire thing will remove. The K-150 is the same. Stick your fingers in, pry apart, the entire K-cup holder will be removed. These guys are dishwasher safe. So when you put them in a dishwasher, the 212 degrees will definitely sterilize anything out of there. But if not, hot water and soap will go ahead and do the same. Now, you can't mess up when you put these back in. They have a three-way tang, and it'll only let you go into one way. Now let's move over to the commercial unit. This is the K3500. This is a little bit different. You'll see the K-cup holder has the pivot that allows it to fall back into the trash can. What I do here is I go ahead and depress these two little tangs inwards. And the entire unit pops out, which is also dishwasher safe. Or quite frankly, you can go ahead and clean it with a little bit of hot soap and water, and it does the same trick. Now, why it's exposed, I use compressed air and a lot of paper towels to go ahead and get the rest of this out of here. I also move its trash can, turn it vertically, and run the unit into the open settings. You'll see some additional grounds and some additional stuff come out. It's a good way to clean the system. Let's go ahead and start this one. I'll show you what I do here. Now watch out, the water is hot. So while I do this, I usually go ahead and use like a Windex or something that is street free for the outside of the machine. But as far as the inside, the 195 degree water really is the best agent to clean this. You'll see that it's scattering everywhere because it's really hitting all these interior features. Now with the water going everywhere like that, it really does get on everything. But the way Curie has designed this lip, it goes ahead and drips and it all drains out to a single unit. Now, when you're finished, take your K-cup holder, simply replace it, snapping it all the way down until the two tangs come into place. Now run it one more time, and when you do that, you'll notice a difference. You're gonna go ahead and hit yes. And as this one rinses, you'll see it funneling directly through the K-cup holder itself, rinsing that out you'll notice some thinner strain. So we're gonna do this process with both of these other machines and then we're gonna wipe down the outside and we're gonna go ahead and hit the reset button on these things. This is pretty much exactly what I'm going to do without the chemicals and that's pretty much gonna get your machines back in use. Now I'm gonna give you guys a suggestion. COVID-19 apparently can live on the outside of hard surfaces for some time. I'm going to suggest to all my clients that you either have a pre-folded paper towel or some sort of paper towel roll nearby. So you don't have to touch the holder itself, but you can use that to be your handle or your cup remover. I think it's just a better way to go about things for now, whether it's your trash can handle or whatever, let's get used to using these paper towels. I think it'll keep us a little bit safer. Now, if you wipe down everything, you dump your water, replace our trash can. Everybody's been put back together. And now run an additional system through each. Now you've cleared out both of your heating tanks. Your machine's ready to go.